Hi everyone, we're going to do some science today. So I'm just going to tell you what equipment we need before we get started. So you are going to need a plate, some milk, some food colouring, and some washing up liquid, and cotton buds. So I'll let you get all of those together, and I'll be back in a second. First things first, you're going to get your plate and you're going to get your milk and you're going to pour the milk onto the plate until you get about half a centimetre of milk. When you've done that, you're going to want to let, to let your milk settle for about a minute or two before you start the experiment, otherwise it won't work properly. So I'm going to leave that for a couple of minutes. And whilst I'm doing that, I'm just going to explain the next bit. So you're going to have some food colouring. And what you're going to need to do, try not to get your hands all messy like me, so maybe have some kitchen roll ready or something to wipe it up with. So you've got your food colouring and what you need to do is put a couple of drops of each colour. So I've got three colours here. And you want to put them right in the centre of your milk on your plate. So I'm going to switch the video around now and show you exactly what I mean by that. And the next step but remember to let your milk settle just for a couple of minutes before you put your food coloring drops in so i've put my colors my food coloring in the middle of my milk and as you can see some of the colors spread out a lot more than the others the blue doesn't spread out at all and the red spread out quite a lot and what i'll see later is there's a bit of a solid sediment from the red food coloring as well so i don't don't know, that's probably something to do with the ingredients. Maybe that's something you could look at with your experiment as well. Do the ingredients of your food colouring affect what happens to it? So what we're going to do now, I've got my colours in there. So I'm going to get my washing up liquid. I'm going to get my cotton bud. And I'm going to put my cotton bud in there. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to put it into my milk. So I'm not going to tell you what is happening here or why it's happening, I would like to see if you can figure out why this is occurring when I mix my milk and food colouring with this washing up liquid, what is happening and why? And how can you change this experiment? So I did say I was gonna use three colours, I've used two in the end, um, and I've used full fat milk, and I've used fairy antibacterial washing up liquid so if you change these things does it matter if you use warm milk or cold milk what else can you change so let's just see what happens when i put this in here Does it matter how many times you put that washing up liquid in? Will it still keep happening? So let us know how you get on with this experiment and maybe send us some pictures of what happens.